everyone, how are you all doing? My name's Lorraine. I'm here to give you a quick general pop-up reading of the subject that's about to come out here. This is still a relationship reading, still general energies. So take from this reading the messages that are being given to you today for when you find this reading, okay? So longer pick card readings will follow this one, so there'll always be longer where you can choose your deck, so never worry about that. This is just a pop-up reading. A lot of you like these readings as well, and I just feel intuitively drawn to film one for you right now, so there must be messages from spirit that needed to be he heard and to get out so let's have a look at the situation here with my tower of the heart cards of what spirit wants you to know right now about your connections or your connection if this isn't your reading today that's fine you can go to the playlist, there's other readings for you. And of course, as I said at the beginning of the video, I am uploading another video really soon. So let's have a look what messages Spirit wants you to know about your connection. No idea what's coming out, so let's have a look. We have the sun in reverse. So there has been some disappointment somewhere in your connection here. The sun in reverse can often be a... A delayed gratification card. So maybe you're waiting for something to, um, something good to happen or something good to come out of your connection here as well. Sometimes this card can come out during readings when what you're trying to materialise and what you're trying to manifest is just not happening the way that you want it to. Sometimes there can be delays to travel with this card as well. And sometimes even social, um, social. I was going to say social media then. Maybe for some of you, there's been maybe a missed um, opportunity to meet your person for some reason. That could be a travel delay, of course, as well. But it's sometimes when the sun card comes out in reverse, it's like there's nothing you can do about it. It's like spirit is saying it's just, it's happened now and this is what it's about. It feels like, also remember when the sun card's reverse, I always feel as a reader that it doesn't rarely stay in reverse for long. So there's always hope that it will kind of rise back up again, yeah? So just, it's kind of temporary is what I'm feeling here to me. Um, it also feels like maybe you feel like possibly the person that you're, um, that's in your life in a romantic way has gone a little cool or colder towards you and you don't know why. Um, it feels like to me that it will be, it's kind of like you have to have some patience with this one when the sun is reversed. It is a card when that sun, like, as I said, the, for me, the sun very rarely reverses in a reading. That's how I am as a reader. But it's like, it's like have some patience, have some faith. But I feel like the questions you're asking is why has your person gone cooler with you? Why have they gone colder with you? Yeah, let's get some more tarots. Let's see what else messages that are coming out here too. Let's get some messages from the Witch's Tarot deck. Okay. Ooh, we have the Four of Wands. So this will... Right, good start, good start. The Six of Cups, right, exactly. Wow, 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 wow. The sun being in reverse, so this is, as I said, things are delayed right now. So there could be outside influences, which is maybe with why your person is acting a little strange or seems to be a bit cooler. There's a reunion happening. You've got two reunion cards, four of wands, six of cups. Um, the lovers has come out here as well. So if it, it feels like to me your person is going to rekindle it's like a re i feel like more or less that things are going to be more passionate especially with the lovers card here and they've got their backsides out here as well and they may even buy you a gift with the six of cups it's like they will give their love back to you in some way so this could be anything from a reunion to a celebration but i feel like you've waited long enough as well is what i want to want to want to say as well the four of wands the card of celebrations it can indicate marriage or wedding you can see here that someone's having a bit of a ceremony here. They are having a ceremony. But it's like somebody, It's. I kind of feel like they want, your person is realising that maybe they're acting a little bit cool towards you. And they're going to kind of 
as I call the Six of Cups, the gift of love or the cup of love. And they're kind of going to recognise it and realise, look, you know, I need to possibly be more romantic or I need to be um, more attentive or I need to take more notice or spend more time with you or message you more or see you more. So I feel like it's about to be rekindled for you here, guys. The Lovers is a great card coming out, isn't it, here? Ta-da! It means your person has these romantic intentions, romantic feelings. In fact, all three of your tarot cards do today. And they're all the right way up as well. So this is telling me that your connection is heading in the right direction. And we have the lover's card here. So it's like you two will you two will get on that same level again. Okay? But it feels like to me that things are there are a few in betweeny problems as I call them so this is a card of things being rekindled or renewed and things getting better I think that as soon as your person recognizes that maybe um they haven't been acting correctly towards you in also all kinds of ways this will be something where they're giving you back what you need that's what I'm feeling what you I want to say what you you are going to receive what you should have that's that's the energy that I'm picking up here as well let me pull some oracle cards out for you as well okay I've pulled out three we've got re soulmate yes this is your soulmate Whoa, so I'm just looking at this picture here. That's why I stuttered there. So this is a very passionate connection for you guys. It feels like to me a person, I, do you know, I want to say a person's going to be more touchy-feely. Am I allowed to say something like that? But I feel like they're going to be much more attentive because this is all about making everything better and making sure that your person is taking notice of you and making sure what am I feeling intuitively? I feel like they're going to make sure that you're their focus, that you'll be priority and number one here as well. I want to get some more cards from the Kipper Tarot deck here. Okay. We have change, we have action. We have a journey when this card comes out. This could be an actual move of house for some of you. Change of address. As you can see, the bags are packed. You may be traveling. Your person might be traveling to meet each other um, with the change card. But this is all action. It's, it reminds me a lot of the chariot. It's like, this has to be done. And I think your person is heading your way here. Maybe they'll just show up at your doorstep <laughs> with their bags packed. Or, hi, you know, I'm on holiday. I come stay with you. Come to see you. But it feels like if there is travel delays or travel problems and you getting to each other, they may be sorted and rectified here. Look at this nine. Look at this nine, number nine change of direction. This is the heading in your direction. They might just want to show up at your house and you're like, oh my God. Um, let's get some more Oracle cards here as well. Whoa. Something's just flipped over my deck. I don't know if you heard that then. We have the card of signs. We've got that lovely hand signal there of heart. Watch out for signs leading you to true love. I feel like some of you already got those signs. I think a lot of you already know that there's something special between you both here. That's what I'm picking up intuitively as well as the cards. It's like, I think a spark has already started. It's too, It's kind of too late. The spark's already started. That That's what I'm feeling here with these cards. Okay, guys, that's your pop-up energy that I've shown, uh, seen for you today. These are general readings. Please bear that in mind. This is a pop-up reading of whatever I was intuitively to read for you. I'm aware that a lot of you are going to take a lot from this reading. Some of you are like... Um, and maybe want to wait for the longer pick of cards if if you haven't seen some of my videos check out the playlists you know even the older ones are timeless so you can still use them and i will be uploading a longer one um really really soon 
I think I'll try and get it up tonight, if not tonight, tomorrow night. So yeah, so watch out for a longer reading as well. But this is still timeless, okay? Thank you ever so much. I'll leave you with this reading. I hope you liked it. Please subscribe to the channel if you are not already a subscriber. Give the video a thumbs up. That'd be really sweet of you as well. And for those of you wishing to donate to Victoria Moon, the link is in the description box below, along with read it, um, private reading links as well. Everything is in the description box. Give it a read as well if you want any more information about private readings or where to donate and thank you everyone for donating as well um to those that have it's really appreciated and it helps keep the channel going thank you so much take care till next time see you soon bye bye